What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Scarlet Let's Play. In the previous episode, we took on the Great Titan, uh, uh, the Great Tusk, I should say, the uh, Waking Titan, or whatever they wanted to call him. Um, and in this episode, we're going to get to this town at the north point of the, well, yeah, the north point of the desert, Porto Marianda, because uh, I want to check it out. And I also want to get this Pokemon Center stop. Uh, see if there's anything there for us. It looks like we got some water routes that we can explore as well, which is actually pretty good for us. Um, and then, yeah, we'll probably take a loop back through West Pro uh, Province Area 2 and try to get over here to Cascarafa. Cas um, and if it turns out that, like, this path is, like, blocked off here, we'll just fly back to West Province Area 1, and we'll slowly make our way towards the Dark Crew base. Because, to be honest, we're gonna have a lot of ground to cover anyways. So, I honestly am okay if we just get, like, the Poke Pokemon Center as, like, a stop, and then, like, that's... That's it. Wait a second. That's a giraffe egg. Don't think. Don't think I didn't see the leak. I know you have a evolution in this game. I don't know how you evolve, but I know you have an evolution. So I think this is gonna be the last video I record for. Well, maybe, maybe for a little bit today. It's. This is gonna be four, right? Just check. Yeah, this will be the fourth one. Just take a little bit of a break from it because I have been playing. I played like a bit off screen this morning, and then I played like. So I did about like maybe an hour and a half, two hours this morning before recording, and then once this video is done, it'll be about two hours. Maybe a little bit more, so probably just need to take a little bit of a break. Don't feel too burnt out. Have it feel fresh. Have me want to come back and play. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna do much off-screen exploring right now. I, I'm not sure. Um, we did end up putting the Tinka Tink on the team. We caught that in the previous episode there in the desert. Um. If you missed out on the previous episode, I highly recommend you guys go and check it out because it was pretty, pretty, I would say pretty important um, because of the, because of the Titan fight, but also in terms of lore, uh, there was some good, there was some important story, I would say, for it um, as well. I actually am like super excited to... And I keep saying this, I know, but I'm super excited to get to the point where I Nuzlocke this game. It'll probably be like a Wonder Lock, but I'm looking forward to it. I think it's going to be so, so, oh, so interesting. Trying to do a Wonder Lock of this game. But yeah, I'm having fun playing. It's definitely, definitely very, very good game. I'm, I'm enjoying it. I know some people are upset with like the amount of glitches and whatnot there are in this game, but I think the idea of the tr the treasure hunt is super neat. Deerling. Oh, this is a different form of deerling too. Should I catch it? Okay. And Ariyama just showed up. What the... The whole gang is here. I honestly think I should catch this hero and to get a different... the... right, uh, evolution. I'm afraid a U-turn to kill it, though. I'm level 32. Yeah. Figured. Figured as much. I could've... I could've probably... Used bite instead. Probably bad, bad call on me. Oh, there's another one. It's fine. Mm -hmm. 
Because I'm trying to get all the forms of Pokemon. That's going to be something that's an objective of mine. Because I want to have it in home where it's like, okay, I have all the forms of... Like, you got Rotom. That's the cyclist I do. And that man is just running around. But, like, yeah, I'm... Super duper uh, interested in trying to get the entirety of like the decks completed, including like all the different forms and whatnot. I know with Pokemon like um, Alternate Crosma, you can't get his Alternate Crosma form unless in the Sun and Moon or Ultra Sun and Moon, sorry. And then with like fuck, what's it called? What's his name? Why am I blanking on his name? Eternatus. Sorry. Man, Cyclozar is... He is zooming everywhere. He does not know what to do. But... I'm gonna try to attempt to get, like, all the Deerling forms because of seasons and whatnot. I know those vary. Um... There are all the Alolan, Galar, and now Paldean forms as well. So, like, there's a, there's a lot for us to keep an eye out. Stunky. Try to catch you as well. I can actually... I don't know. I'm. I think it's something I can do, especially because I know Pokebank. I think Pokebank is supposed to be done. Like you can't use it after March, so I gotta work on it fast if I want to do that because I beat pretty much like all the games I wanted to play, so I gotta transfer them all over to home at some point. I did. I didn't paralyze you, right? I did. Okay. I don't have any more. I don't have any great balls now. I honestly think I should lead off with Peppercroc now because Bandita has just gone away. Gone gone way ahead in levels compared to compared to Peppercroc. And I don't I don't want to show favoritism. But also, like, it's my actual, like, starter starter, so. Damn, we almost have three full boxes of Pokemon caught. That is super, super nice. I'll put you in the front. There's the kid we gotta fight. I'm just trying to make sure I'm not seeing any other new, new dudes pop up. Flaffy, I could catch to get closer to Ampharo, so that wouldn't be a bad idea. There's the match chip again. Mm. Yeah, I think we just, we just gotta go forward. Just go into the town. There's Bommy. There's a uh, the oink alone or whatever it's called. I believe that's what it's called. Hey, what does Casaroya mean? That's all I can think about recently. I don't know. Yasin the student? There's a Tauros behind him. 
I didn't even... to see A, if Tauros has an evolution, but also B, what it is. Masquerade. So, okay, so we just, we just move out, moves out on our stab, but it moves out super effective. Fine. So I'm guessing that the starters are all going to evolve at 36, maybe? Because Bandita didn't evolve at level 32, which is traditional when it comes to like the grass starters. Hey, buddy. even, dare I say, that is even better. It, I'm a little upset just because I actually did want the Tauros, but the fact that we finally found Ditto is good. And I don't care if he transforms into this, because this thing is going to be able to do a whole lot. But I do need a swap. I need a swap into you. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do not have it die. But it's okay, because it's not a Nuzlocke, so. To be honest, I just need to get the paralysis on me. If I can get the paralysis on me, it's okay if Aramosa goes down. Resisted. I don't know why you went for that. But does. Does that mean Tauros can be found in this route? That's that's the million dollar question. Does that mean Tauros can be found in this route? Because if he can. Oof. Say what? Well, I'm trying to figure out why Zen all of a sudden is like. Like he's flying instead of how he was standing still when I first first had him. Oh, now you don't want to stay far. There's no way you're going based off of Ditto's touch. Right? I guess I did Ultra Ball. Right? Oh, really? Did I weaken this thing? I want to say, maybe. I'm going to have to hit this thing. I'm just afraid because it was level, it's level 22, right? Double kick is effective. Pounce is not very effective. Wing attack is not very effective. I'm not wing attack it. That should be perfect. And stay caught. They must have changed this. Because you could literally send in whatever mod you wanted into against Ditto. And like make it easy as possible. And I want to say that Tinkatink had the easiest catch rate in our entire party, but 
I guess not. Because it's not fucking saying God. It is in the yellow and paralyzed. Maybe you want a maybe you want a Pokeball. Maybe you don't want an Ultra Ball or a Great Ball. Maybe you just want traditional, regular, standard Pokeball. No? Do you think the Ball would work on it? I don't know, because I think it's probably trying to take Ditto. I think it's trying to take Ditto's catch rate and not what I actually have it in as. But the problem is, is that this thing is going to end up struggling eventually. does keep getting paralyzed, too. I want the Ditto for breeding. Thank you. I, gotta, I needed a crit capture. I needed a crit capture. Oh, my God. Wait, did I even... I just realized something. I don't even know if I, like, transferred all the mons that I had from BDSP out of BDSP yet. I should probably do that. I'm gonna send you to a box real quick. Ooh, you're a fucking problem. Jesus Christ. Revive you. And let's try to get to the town. I don't see anything that's gonna catch my eye this time. The Tauros caught my eye. Oh, okay, okay, Jesus Christ, that man is <laughs> fucking zooming. Calm down. Cyclops are really just be running around. There's the rock mushroom guy. Giraffe right. Get away from that Pokeball, please. Thank you. Oh, there's Taurus again. Be the real one this time. He is. Yay. Oh. Shit, that man got a Oh my god, there's a bunch of them now. Couldn't find any of you fuckers, and now you're here. I have no, I have no idea what typing is. I feel like dark type. I feel like you are a dark type in some capacity. Wait, why is it... Wait, why does he have red... Stuff on his back. Well, we're about to find out because level 33. Oh, I'm trying to see. I'm trying to see why he's like that. Why are you, what, what makes you special? Is it like a male female difference? Oh, he's got intimidate though. Is that a female Taurus we fought initially? Maybe. Wait, do it. Why does it say this time that's not not very good? Is he dark and fire? I gotta see what the other one is then. Because it was not... It was not resisted. How the fuck am I gonna try to catch this thing? I feel like he's just gonna murder me.
is there like an actual difference between like male and female typing? And if so, is that the first time it's like that? I don't know. I gotta see when I get out of this cutscene, or, yeah, this animation. He's fighting in fire, okay. I'm intrigued, I'm very intrigued. He had Intimidate too, which is actually super duper good. Oh my god, this might be a competitive made Tauros. Jolly nature? Holy shit. I'm gonna send out a box. Something tells me that. I need to see. Why is this one not fire? Are there two different forms? He just knocked himself out because he's gonna put me in blaze range. I'm gonna kill him now. Huh. I'm trying to learn flamethrower already. Hell yeah. Get rid of incinerate. Fuck that noise. Flamethrower? W. I don't know what's making that noise next to me. But whatever it is, it's kind of annoying. Is that another Tauros? Just... Okay, that was Meowth that was making that noise. Okay, I'm going to stun spore you. And I'm going to side beam you. As well. Please, for the love of God, do not die. I'm, I don't. I can't put my finger on how that one Tauros was different from the others. Like I wanna I want to know so bad. Doesn't make sense. So we got a crit capture, nice. Diva's level twenty-four. Brutal swing. I feel like that's a move perfect for you to be honest. What do you wanna get rid of? Get rid of Rock Smash? No. Honestly, get rid of Covet. Covet isn't super effective on anything. What? What is the difference, though? I don't... I don't know what the difference is. This has anger point. Oh boy. Oh, you're evolving already. Did it need to Did it need to learn Brutal Swing to evolve? Now it definitely looks like Diva. 
Tinker Turf. This Pokemon will attack groups of Ponyard and Bisharp, gathering metal from them in order to create a large, sturdy hammer. Jesus, that's kind of vicious. Yeah, I'm gonna assume there's another evolution for you. Okay, I mean... Maybe that's something I have to check out off screen. I, I didn't think... I would have to think about that, but... I also have made, like, no progress. I haven't made it into the town yet. Okay, Cyclozar. Cyclozar is the definition of... Let your dog run at the dog park. He is... He is zipping around every which way. Okay, Joaquin the Corey? Get a rough play. Am I leaning right? Oh, okay. I mean, who are ya? 23? Ah, I'm fine. Okay. I am okay. God damn, Tauros, relax. Can you race, Cyclozar? I came across the desert with my Cyclozar and I'm totally exhausted. True. In this battle, so far you defeated, you defeat four trainers. Okay, I get four trainer fights. So. That'll surely happen. Yeah, I need to heal up. I see curly up. Is there anything? Jesus Christ, a little in section over here. Fuck okay, it, let's try to get in the town at the very least. Porto Mar Marionata. going into, like, houses and actually like, being able to. Like, talk to people and get items and shit. Like, that was cool. That was a fun time. Chipped pot. Alright, so that's for Sinistee. There's a body of water here. Oh, there's a section I can run across, so. I will right, we'll go down and get this. Poison jab. That could be good. A vending machine down here. Can I actually get anything? Yes. What about from this vending machine? Nope. It's a bow. The dock. These big box, long metal box things are what we call shipping containers. Yeah, I know that. Bro, she's. She's built, holy. Can I go in here? Nope. Love them. Love how they're just like chilling on their cycles are. Like like motorcycles, like it's kind of fun. Salty breeze. Stop on by. All your good all our goods are fresh and fresh. It's like a Farmer's market, almost? It looks like it anyways. Damn, I got that item through the fence. Yeah, fuck. Fuck that. Fuck that barrier. I'm doing things how I want to do it.
just gonna see if there's anything. When I read the name Kofu uh, a couple episodes back, I think it was, I was like, Kofu, that sounds like Kung Fu. And I was thinking Kung Fu when he said Kofu, and I was like, oh yeah, Kofu. Yeah, I know that, and it's like, wait, no, I'm thinking of something completely different. Jesus! Look at that! Okay, that, that, ooh! There's plenty of spot for me to, uh, explore. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna do any exploring in between episodes. Probably not. I think just next episode I'm gonna explore the town. And then, since we got the fly spot up to there, I might trek through this way and see if this gets us into Kaskarapa. If we do get into Kaskarapa, I'm not going to fight uh, the gym leader. I'm going to save it because I want to go and do this. I want to do it in this order because we haven't done we haven't done any of the Team Star bases yet. We've done two of the Titans, only one of the gym leaders. So it's just right. It's it's her. I don't ex and I feel like I'm gonna have to- I feel like I'd fight her last. I'm gonna end up going all the way around. I wonder if I went right. How much different that would've went. I don't know. Either way, we're gonna wrap up the video here. Hopefully you guys- oh. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Nope. Come back. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed because I'm having a blast playing this game. And uh, yeah, we'll be back. I'll probably be recording again tonight when I'm back um, home. So we'll see. For right. But yeah, um, if you guys enjoyed, hit that like button, subscribe. Um, make sure you click the bell icon so you don't miss on anything that we're doing on our channel. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys in the next episode. Peace out.